<clears throat> Damn it, I had something useful to say. Now that I'm recording, I don't remember what it was. I'm so tired. Um, we were going to, we're cutting out the first set of front. Mm. Oh, right. Okay, so medieval tailoring techniques. So of course, we're basically reinventing the wheel in many cases, trying to ascertain how they did these things when, whereas medieval tailors knew how they did these things already. They didn't have to waste fabric experimenting on it. So what that meant is that frequently the mock-up was the lining of the garment. So once the lining was fitted, then they would make the finished garment and make any final adjustments. Whereas here, I'm working in, in a fabric that will become in essence the pattern for the thing once it's all adjusted. Now, granted, for future ones, if I like this pattern and my Kondotiro's body doesn't change shape drastically, then I would actually do the same thing. I would cut the mock-up out of the linen lining for the, the farsetto, make any adjustments, and then cut out the fashion fabric. But for now, we're working in a cotton, uh, an upcycled cotton curtain, actually. So here we go. Here is the Okay, here is uh, the finished piece, um, at least how it's going to be. Now there's going to be a false seam is actually put in here on the original. So we'll be putting that in and uh, then the, the back panels will get to Pepla. So let's put it, let's baste it all together and see how it fits. <coughs> <coughs> 